Hey guys, it's Jessica here again and I'm giving you guys a weekly update on my weight loss journey. Hopefully all of you guys have had a chance to see my original video that has my whole plan on it. But this is my update number two, so this is week number two. Um, and I wanted to let you guys know how it went and you know everything that, that happened last week. So if you guys get a chance, please make sure to check out that video. I'll link it down below. And please make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you share it with somebody. Um, subscribe so that, that way you guys can get an alert every time my weekly updates are up. And you guys can join me on this journey together to 30 pounds of weight loss. So let's get started. As far as last week, the way that it went, um, it didn't go actually as bad as I thought it was. Like it was, it's definitely getting easier, I think, now that I'm getting more into the rhythm of it. So the two days that I do 500 calorie days, which is Mondays and Thursdays, um, I think they worked out a lot easier because I'm getting more into the groove of things and I'm able to plan out my meals. And so it's easier to stay on track on those days. The other days were also really good. Um, I think Wednesday was really the only day that I went out um, you know, to eat that something that wasn't on my meal plan. I'm trying to do low calorie and I went to go eat tacos with my mom and uh, my son. And so definitely not part of the meal plan. But other than that, I was able to stick to it. I've been doing really good with drinking my apple cider vinegar in the morning, uh, drinking more water, going to the gym. Um, I did only go to the gym three days last week as well, which is not what I had been planning. I've been wanting to go five days out of the week. But when I go, um, I've been working out a little bit harder because of that pre-workout that I'm drinking. And I had it on my previous video. Um, it does actually help. It helps me to be able to push myself a little bit harder. So I've noticed that days later, I'm still sore. So I'm, I'm really doing a good job at the gym, I think. Um, so at the end of the week on Saturday, I weighed myself Saturday morning. And I was very happy, very proud of myself because according to... My scale, I had lost five pounds, five pounds. To me, five pounds is a lot. I, I even thought at the moment, like, this is way too good to be true. So when the weekend came along, I let loose a little bit. And I definitely let loose a lot more than I did the first weekend. Um, so I ate out a lot, breakfast, lunch, dinner. We went on a date night, me and my boyfriend. Uh, we went out to lunch to celebrate my mom's birthday. I went out with my best friend on Friday for drinks. So... Monday, I weighed myself again, and I had gained back three of the five pounds that I lost. So total weight loss for last week was two pounds, which is still really good. The first week was three pounds. This past week was two. So that means that I am at a total of five pounds lost. I still haven't found a way to keep track, like a visual yet, but um, I did lose five pounds. So now 25 more pounds to go. And... So far, this week has been going very well. Today's Tuesday, so Monday, I did my 500 calorie day. It went well. I've been going to the gym. Uh, tomorrow, I probably won't have a chance to hit the gym, but I'll be helping my mom pack up her house, so I still consider that exercise. Um, but so far, it's doing very well, and I'm very happy with my results. So I'll keep you guys posted next week and let you know how it goes. Bye.